Hey y'all, welcome back to the kitchen. Uh, today, probably going to be a little quick video. Uh, I'm hungry for some pork chops. Uh, couldn't decide what, how I wanted to make them. Uh, whether just barbecued ones or you know seasoned or just whatever. But uh, however I do, do them up, it's going to be in the air fryer because I love my air fryer. So I want to get over here. We're going to get things set up and uh, we'll get to air frying. Catch you in a minute. Alright y'all, um, this is going to be like a super simple, easy meal. Uh, now my air fryer is a little bigger than your average one, but and these are thin pork chops, so I just get mine in here. Get them kind of laid out. Yeah, it don't matter if they're touching or not. At least not in mine it doesn't. There we go. Alright. Now we got them in there. Now, I am going to barbecue. Uh probably two or maybe three of them uh, but uh, the other ones <clears throat> I think I'm gonna barbecue two of them and then I'm just gonna put uh, perfect seasoning on the other ones and then just put it down in the air fryer um, I trade my air fryer, but it's off in a dark corner, and it's hard to get a, you know, video of the, of the, uh, video don't turn out good, I tried before, but, um, mine just, you just sit it down in like that, it's a big glass bowl type deal, so, um, I'm gonna get those in, I'm gonna preheat it first though, uh, at 400 for five minutes, and then, uh, we'll cook them probably seven minutes on one side, and then, at 400 and then flip them over uh, check the temperature on them see how they're doing and then roughly another seven minutes five to seven minutes on the second side and at that point I'll put my barbecue sauce on the uh, other ones so we'll get that done and uh, we'll bring you guys back all right y'all I drug my air fryer over here got it all stretched out so being very careful, sides are hot, so got my pork chops down in there. My lid just goes on like that. Set my temperature. Set my time. That's all there is to it. So we're gonna let those cook, and uh, we'll bring y'all back. All right, y'all, first cook through, uh, our first side, we're down to a minute, so let this sucker cook through. y'all look at them suckers there I mean they look beautiful with dilicious and uh, so we're ready to do the next and myself and this is the barbecue sauce we're gonna be using so a little sweet and spicy just like me I just like to get a, a coating on one side. And we're going to flip them over. And 
Now y'all, I use this thing basically every day. Whether it's heating up some the pre-made brown and serve sausage patties for breakfast. That's one of my favorite things to have for breakfast uh, during the week. So, alright. Get a little bit of seasoning on this side. Did I just put the seasoning on the... No. This is the... Yeah, that's the... <laughs> Forget which ones had seasoning and which ones didn't. Alright, now. Give me a little barbecue sauce on the other two here. Gotta be very careful because, like I said, this thing's glass. And it is hot, 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 so... Alright, nope, dribbled a little bit on the other one, but I'll be alright. We like barbecue sauce, so. Alright, now, put the lid back on her. I guess it's not the lid, it's the actual heating unit. Bump it up to 400, and the way those look, I'm gonna go 10 minutes. So, and there are presets on my thing, but I just do it manually, so. Hit that, and uh, away we go. So, 10 minutes, we'll bring y'all back. All right, y'all, that timer just went off. So, let's get the uh, topper off of here. Woohoo, look at that. That looks awesome. Nice, slightly brown around the edges. The uh, barbecue sauce is on there. So, I'll grab my uh, thermometer, my instant read. We're just going to double check, make sure we're safe. Oh yeah, 165. That's 170. Like I said, these are thin ones. If you do one a little thinner or with bones in them, you may have to put them in for a little longer. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, now I'm going to drizzle these couple back here, the barbecued ones, with just a little bit more barbecue sauce. And we're going to put them in for like maybe another five minutes, maybe. And uh, just to kind of get that barbecue sauce, so, get that barbecue sauce uh, good and uh, kind of crispy ishness on there. So. See if we can't oh, not over pour this one. Usually I put this in a little bowl and get it out of there, but I was being lazy tonight. Alright. Like I said, uh, probably three to five minutes. Let's go five. Just to make sure. bring y'all back when that this is done all right y'all timer just went off Ooh, those things look delicious now even more so so i'm gonna move them over to the side here got our cutting board a little bit of that seasoning off of there we're gonna grab one of these the barbecued one there one of the other ones and then we're gonna slice into these things Ooh, those look juicy and tender mm. spin this thing around here and hey don't escape Ooh, I mean, y'all, that is, I mean, I'm just pushing down on that knife. That's how tender these pork chops are. Oh, man. All right, I'm going to get these in a plate. We'll do our little taste test. 
All right, y'all. I busted out the good china for tonight. You know the, the paper plates. But hey, I'm the one who has to do the dishes. So, all right, we're gonna try a little bit of this, just the seasoned one. Mmm. Good, tender. A little bit of that barbecue, that sweet, sweet and spicy barbecue. Mmm. Oh. Y'all. That is awesome. Mmm. I'm telling y'all. If you ain't got an air fryer, y'all need to look into getting one. Like I said, I use mine almost every day. And I use it for everything. I cook wings in it. I cook sausages in it. You know, patties. You know, hamburgers. Chicken breasts. You know, everything. I mean, I, I cook... I've even, before my stir my keto diet, I used to get these little small pizzas and put in there and cook them. So, you know, you can cook anything in them. Uh, I'm going to try some dippy eggs in it here, come up soon, as soon as I can get a little pan that fits down in there. So, anyways, getting off on another subject there, but appreciate y'all. Hope you like this one. I know it's just a little quick one, but, you know, sometimes a quickie's a goodie. So, love y'all, and as always, bear appetit. Oh. Like, comment, subscribe. Helps the channel. Catch y'all in the next one.